How did you go by and creating, making each poem work as a sort of a um, exposition and rising action and climax in a story like that? Uh, it's, I didn't start like at the beginning and say this is where it starts with the storm's voice and, and go mm -hmm. that way. I didn't set out to write a book about Hurricane Katrina. I wanted to write one poem. And there was a story that, uh, you know, if you're a writer, a creative artist, something, you see something that just pushes at you, pushes at you, and you say, I don't have time to write this, I can't, uh, maybe not. And it pushes at you, and you know, I have to. So the one story that, that had a hold on me that way was the story of the 34 nursing home residents. Mm -hmm. yeah. And uh, that's the poem that I set out to write. I write a lot of persona poems. Uh, and there was so much tragedy doing Katrina, tragedy stacked on tragedy. So after a while, we stopped thinking. We didn't really see names or faces. We just saw events. And so our focus would be here, we'd go over here, we'd go over here. So what I wanted to do with that poem was give each of those 34 people a couple of seconds of their voice back. 